some of you guys asked me if uh, I have uh, water on my property so today I will uh, show you the water sources in this area this uh, mountain is full of springs so yeah we have to walk a bit This is the first water source. I'll come back later and I will uh, clean it a bit. And uh, in the near future, I will uh, build a basin and uh, connect the water through a hose down to my place. right into the cabin so I have uh, running water in my house without electricity just through the power of gravity the water is very very good very sweet one of the tastiest I ever drank see the other one is a bit more hardly accessible this is the spring under the walnut this is also very good drinkable water it needs to be cleaned as well so this is the third water source it has a bigger water flow and uh, it's suitable for providing fresh water for a fish pond which is in the project as well this is the other side of on the other side of the road and a uh, half of a plastic bottle which I use to bring uh, running water right to my camp Well, I may have 
over the honey a bit but it should be all right I'll come back tomorrow to see after the water is uh, clearing up how it looks like well that's quite some work this is a couple of days later the water cleared up almost entirely it doesn't look bad for a few hours of work this, this is excellent very cold and actually sweet it's perfect This is just a temporary solution, so don't laugh. So here's the source. There is about 30 meters to the camp. We have running water in the camp. It's warm from the hose. Good.